What's going on? It's D-Man, you already know. Bringing to you some more NBA 2K13 tips. You know I bring the great tips to you all. Try to help you all out a little bit. Anyways, today I'm going to teach you how to flop, basically. How to get those charge calls to go your way. First off, you want to make sure the guy you're trying to flop with has this signature skill, which is the charge card. It basically makes the player a better flopper. So people like uh, Marcin Gortat has it. Luis Golo, you know he has it. Boy, he be flopping all over the place. I think the whole Clippers team have it too. <laughs> if anybody remember that playoff series. But anyways, I'm not saying that this charge card is necessary, but it'll just help the case a little bit more. But anyways, let's get into the gameplay. The way you flop is, if a person is backing you down with a center and they keep doing the aggressive bet down like this, all you gotta do, double tap that B button. You see that charge call, people. Now, I'm gonna replay it a couple times so you can see it clearly. And basically, you all know that you flop with the B button. You gotta press it twice. But if you time it correctly when somebody's doing an aggressive back down, your guy will just fall over and sometimes they'll call a charge. It's only sometimes. It can't work all the time or that'd be cheese. People will be exploiting it left and right. I'm going to show you a couple clips of this working here. No, sometimes it'll be a blocking call. Sometimes you'll pull the chair out on your opponent. But it's basically simple. You know, 2K didn't tell us how to do this. They said um, it only works certain ways. And I, I'm guessing this is one of the ways right here. You know, if somebody keep doing an aggressive bat down with the White Howard or Blake Griffin or any big man. Just double tap that B button, get that charge to go your way, get your flop on, son. Anyways, I hope this little video helped out a little bit. I'll let you all later. Peace.